You might not know this, but I edit videos for some YouTubers. One of them being the YouTuber Easy Speezy. But how does one go about doing that? Well, in today's video, I'm going to explain it, but in a cool way. First thing I do is receive the intel from a program called Dropbox. He sends it in, I pick it up. It's like a drug deal. Next, I throw that bad boy into Adobe Premiere on my MacBook Pro that costs more than my car. Almost like I got my money from drug dealing. After interrogating the video and making sure he wasn't followed, I start chopping. Like some fingers, if you snitch. See how this bar here turned purple? Yeah, that's Easy's voice audio. And it's purple because I started strangling it and it couldn't breathe. So I look at these peaks in audio and wherever I see a gap, BANG! Chopped right there. Going to where the next peak is, BANG! Now, delete it faster than your search history on a Tuesday morning when it's a snow day in January. And get that right-click default transition, which allows that audio to flow smoother than butter on white bread. Cause weed is gross. Now this goes on for a while of doing this same thing over and over again, so make sure you take a break to think. I should be editing that video. All right, you spent your precious hours of your life that you'll never get back, and it's all chopped up. Now it's time for the fun part. Zoom! Zoom in here like an American sniper scope on a terrorist. Zoom out there like that child who stole my PS4, who I willingly shot claiming home defense. Now sometimes you gotta add that background music to just absolutely jam to. Nothing like slapping in the Balloon Tower Defense 5 soundtrack and calling it a day. Now I need to watch it though and realize that I'm really bad at what I do and refix everything. Cut here, a zoom there, why didn't I just go to college? Okay, last thing I need to do is render the video, which means Adobe Premiere is forced by me to render this absolute atrocity that I've created and make it so that it's good for the good old YouTube. I send the intel back to Easy, and he lets me out his basement for 10 minutes so I could see the sun for once and remember what it's like to be free. And that's how we do it. So thank you for watching, and special thanks to R. Mile for the Emperor Penguin Patreon status. If you'd like to be featured as well, link to my Patreon in the description. All right, this was a short one, but I'll see you all in the next one. Toodles!